hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel another day another scholarship so today we'll be talking about a fantastic scholarship in italy a fantastic scholarship in italy and remember if you have a student's visa in italy either through um, a scholarship or through self-funded um coming as a self-funded student you have access to other EU countries. You can always move to Germany, you can move to um, Austria and other France and other countries around. So that is one key benefit of studying in the country, in the EU. So let's return to our scholarship. So this is a scholarship at the University of Calabria, Università della Calabria. And um, these are master's scholarships in um, English taught courses so you do not need to learn Italian these courses are already taught in English so this is a call for application so they're calling for students um, around the world international students around the world to subscribe to some courses in the university however they'll be funding or providing scholarship for a number of um, English taught masters courses English taught master's courses and um, there are different courses as well in the university but pay attention to the particular ones which they will be funding and this funding will cover this is it here for the academic year 2021 2022 the university will be giving a hundred and 20 scholarships that's a very high number to foreign students enrolled to english taught master's degrees the scholarship will include um, university fee usually about a thousand euros and free accommodation as well as well as canteen access this is good so it takes care of feeding <laughs> and then um, pocket money as well so this is a good one it covers a tuition fee accommodation um, canteen access that's some food and the pocket money as well worth a thousand seven hundred so and the deadline for this scholarship is the 14th of May um, 2021 so there are lots of other bits of info here you might want to to read but remember only English taught masters are eligible for this um, scholarship and so let's see how do we apply for this how do we apply for this for this scholarship so remember the information we saw already english taught masters what the scholarships will cover and then the admissions requirements or the documents you need to submit remember these documents should be merged into one PDF single PDF document. So your documents usually are quite different. You have things like the transcript, your CV, your international passport. You are meant to combine all these documents into one PDF file. And I've showed how to do this before, but in case you're confused, just go to Google and type merge or combine PDF, and Google will give you how to do it. It's quite simple. There are websites already that will help you do that under two three minutes and you have all your documents in one file in one document all your different documents in one document yeah you get the point so these are the documents you need to submit the first page of your passport your cv your high school diploma your um, bachelor's degree your transcript they also said university syllabus for all courses i think our uh, transcript will take care of that as well then Italian language certificate if in possession, but we do not need that. Remember, we're looking at just English taught masters. The scholarship we're interested in are uh, for English taught masters only. An English language certificate. If you do have an English cert um, language certificate, please include. If you do not, probably get a letter from your school attesting to the fact that you're proficient in English language and any other documents you think is relevant to the application. So here, this is how to register. You can check it on your own and 
particular step-by-step -step guidance on how to register and of course the link to this um, scholarship will be at the description box of this video and remember the deadline the deadline is um, the 14th of May 2021 and you can only apply for one course you can only apply for one course so which courses are eligible for this scholarship let's look at the eligible courses quickly let's look at the eligible courses and then um, here you go these are the eligible courses and the number available for scholarships so for instance in engineering and technology area for artificial intelligence and computer science you have 12 scholarships and there are 40 slots so all the self-funded students domestic students and the rest will be paying for um will be will be filling the other 40 slots why the, those of us looking for scholarship or those of you looking for scholarships you have 12 spots for this course and there you go just look at the other courses and see the number of scholarships available and the number of spots as well so these are the areas available for this scholarship i must confess they are mostly stem based courses yeah you have a number of engineering i think uh, artificial intelligence so you have biological health sciences nutrition science yeah you have chemistry mathematics physics and then um, finance and insurance here so i would i must admit that it's quite um, a bit limited but this is still something especially if your your area of specialization or your area of interest is among one of these um, courses and that is it there's a short one in case you're interested in a um, fully funded scholarship in italy at the university of Calabria, I believe. So the application process is quite simple. But in case you have any further questions, please put it down below. But make sure you read through the information before you ask any question. I've said that lots of time. I noted that a number of people do not take time to read through the information, do not read through the course requirements, but to rush to ask questions and most times the answers to the questions they're looking for are in plain sight already covered in some part of this um, website so do your research but in case their matters arise and not covered already after you've done your research about the courses you're interested in and how to apply then feel free to reach out it's, and that's it guys i hope this was useful and i'll see you in the next one until then bye bye